Hello, I'm the Canadian Bartender. Welcome to my channel where I show you how to make crafty cocktails at home. Today, for some reason, I'm in a tequila mood. So I'm going to show you how to make the refreshing Paloma. Let's get into it. The Paloma, a tequila cocktail. When people, at least the people I know, think about tequila in Mexico, they automatically go margarita. But what they should be thinking about first is the national cocktail Paloma. It's bright and refreshing and traditionally very simple. Tequila, lime juice, and grapefruit soda. But because this is a craft cocktail show, I'm going to show you how to make it with a little bit more complexity. Some different layers, some diversity, some more ingredients. So let's check out those ingredients. The base is tequila. So we've got our Blanco tequila from Casamigos. We have freshly squeezed grapefruit juice, freshly squeezed lime juice, simple syrup, one part sugar, one part water, club soda, we're using Canada Dry. And because I love how it plays so much with grapefruit, rosemary, a grapefruit slice for garnishing, and some coarse salt to rim your glass with. That's it. Those are all the ingredients. Let's pour, shall we? Now you are also going to need a lime wedge to wrap it around the rim. Sometimes with cocktails, I don't like to put the salt all the way around the rim, but in this case, with this glass, with this tall glass, uh, I really think it's best, at least visually, to go around the top. This is a coarse sea salt. You can go with kosher salt, whatever you like, really. And you've got your lime rim and you're dipping it into the salt. Make sure it gets all the way around. And there you go. Now we're gonna fill this up with ice and set it off to the side for later. If you've been watching this channel, you know I like my drinks icy. Get it right up to the top and you can wait for us over there. The rest of these ingredients, going right into the tin. We'll start with the base. One and a half ounces of Blanco tequila. Two ounces of freshly squeezed grapefruit juice. Pre-measured, so I'm just dropping it right in there. Half an ounce of lime juice. Now I've played around with the lime juice and the simple syrup, and I find that these measurements are just right. Just half an ounce of simple syrup. So the reason why we are putting some simple syrup into this cocktail is because we've gone with the fresh grapefruit juice, so it needs to be leveled out, when traditionally the grapefruit soda is much more sweet. And then like I said, I love how rosemary complements drinks with grapefruit in it. So I'm adding a couple little arms, whatever you call it, of, of rosemary. I'm gonna wake it up on the back of the hand and put it in the tin. And now from here, I'm adding ice and shaking. I've got about five or six cubes in here. Make sure you got a good seal on it and shake until you see a nice chill on here. Uh, you're going for a good 20 to 30 seconds. So off we go. We're going to open it up. We're going to double strain. Just add some air into the cocktail. It'll also catch any extra bits of, you know, with the fresh juices or the rosemary. So the double strainer is a good call. And you're going to leave a bit of room at the top. Look at that color. And then you've got your chilled club soda that you are just going to top it off with. You got your bar spoon. If you're liking these tools that I'm using, uh, there is a link down below. I do get a little kickback from Amazon from it, so uh, it helps out if you are enjoying this. Give it just a little stir. And now for the garnish. Again, we've got the rosemary. Open it up across the back of the hand. Just gets the aromas out a little bit for your guest or for yourself. Slide it down the side like so. And then I've got a quartered slice of grapefruit that you're just gonna tuck into the side as well. And there you have it, your Paloma. I'm gonna give this a taste, but before I do, please consider subscribing, but no pressure, eh? Get together and sip together. Cheers, everyone. A little bit of the salt off the edge. A refreshing drink, perfectly balanced. Like I said, it's got some layers, complexities to it. Off the nose, you're getting the rosemary, and then like I said, I love how it plays with the grapefruit, the fresh grapefruit juice. When you take your sip, you're getting the grapefruit juice, the tequila, the lime, the salt lifts things up. This would be a perfect cocktail. 
in those spring months, those summer months. I live up here in Canada, so we do have seasons. Keep the conversation going. Tequila keeps things loose. Cheers, everyone. The Paloma. Think about this next time you want tequila. Have a good one. Ding, ding, da, ding, ding, ding.